Hey, what is up you guys? It's VJ of Yugatech, and when looking at laptops to buy, the first thing that catches our attention isn't the processor, the amount of RAM, or even the graphics card, but it's the price. Striking the right balance between price and performance is quite tricky, so that's why we'll be going over some of the best laptops you can find today for just under 50,000 pesos. This is a sweet spot as you'll find ultrabooks with great builds and specs that could tackle pretty much anything you throw at it. You'll even find some gaming laptops that carry an RTX 3050 or 3050 Ti, which is pretty impressive considering the price. Now let's get to it! Starting with the Huawei MateBook 14, not to be confused with the MateBook D14 as the MateBook 14 carries a much improved design and build. Its 2K display is absolutely perfect for productivity since it carries a taller 3x2 aspect ratio that doesn't feel as cramped as the traditional 16x9 display. It also comes with an AMD Ryzen 5 processor, up to 16GB of RAM, and 512GB of storage. It also charges via USB-C with its compact 65W pocket charger. All things considered, knowing you can get the MateBook 14 for as low as 48,999 pesos makes it a great bargain. If you're simply looking for a great all-rounder with no fuss and great reliability, then check out the Asus VivoBook Pro 14. It carries AMD's Ryzen 7 5800H, 16 gigs of RAM, 512 gigs of storage, and AMD Radeon graphics. Its 14-inch 16x10 display is also a sweet spot for viewing content and productivity, not to mention that its panel is also a 2.8K OLED for a great viewing experience that offers also a 90Hz refresh rate and a 0.2 millisecond response time for a smoother experience. The Asus VivoBook Pro 14 is truly a solid option for anyone really and is priced at just 49,995 pesos. If you are a fan of the Asus VivoBook Pro 14 but want a little more class and portability, then check out the Asus ZenBook 13. The ZenBook series is Asus's premium laptop lineup, with the ZenBook 13 built out of aluminum and with it just weighing 1.14 kilograms. The display is also where it differs though as it's a 13.3 inch 16x9 OLED display which is absolutely gorgeous when watching your favorite shows. It's also no slouch despite being such a thin and light laptop with its Intel Core i5 1135G7 processor, 16GB of RAM, and 512GB of storage. Now, the actual MSRP is a little beyond our budget here, but you can often find the ZenBook 13 for as low as 47,793 pesos in Asus's official Shopee or Lazada stores. If you're a student or anyone really who loves to game on the side, but also has some school or office work to do, then check out the Lenovo IdeaPad Slim 5 Pro. It comes with the AMD Ryzen 5 5600U, 16 gigs of RAM, and 512 gigs of SSD storage. But what's great is that some models come with integrated AMD Radeon graphics, but another spec also sees it with the NVIDIA GeForce MX450, making it terrific for some light gaming or video editing here and there. Do also note that there are two display options with a 14-inch 2.8K 90Hz display or 14-inch 2.2K 60Hz display. If you're also willing to spend just a little extra, you can even get it with a Ryzen 7 5800U processor which makes it quite a powerful little laptop. You can find various specs of the Lenovo IdeaPad Slim 5 Pro for roughly around 47,999 pesos. Now some of us may need some extra screen real estate, and that's where 15-inch laptops come in. The HP Pavilion 15 comes with a large 15.6-inch Full HD display. The Ryzen 5 5625U processor, 16 gigs of RAM, and to top it off, 1 terabyte of SSD storage. It also comes in an aluminum build in a really nice fog blue colorway and has a numpad at the side if you need it for some intense number crunching. This makes it a great value coming in at just 49,995 pesos. Now did you know Intel even made its own laptop? Well they do. The Intel NUC M15 offers a pretty compelling package by packing in the Intel Core i5 1135G7 processor, Intel Iris Xe graphics, 16GB of RAM, and 1TB of storage. It also has a 15.6-inch display with a pretty premium and professional design that looks very stylish in the office or at school. With all things considered, 
The Intel NUP M15 is a great deal knowing that it comes in at only 42,990 pesos. Now if you find yourself gaming a little more than usual and you still want a thin and light ultrabook, then look at the MSI Prestige 14. Cause what sets it apart from the previous ultrabooks mentioned is the inclusion of a GTX 1650 graphics card. And considering that this is a 14 inch ultra portable that weighs just 1.29 kilos, makes the Prestige 14 a pretty impressive device. It also comes with the Intel Core i5 1155G7 processor, 8 gigs of RAM with an extra slot for expansion, and 512 gigs of SSD storage. So if you still want to look professional in school or work, but also do some more intense tasks like gaming or video editing, you can find the MSI Prestige 14 for just 49,999 pesos. Now if you're looking for a laptop that requires more horsepower for more demanding tasks, whether it be gaming, video editing, or maybe you're in a course in college that requires it, that's where gaming laptops come in. And the MSI GF6310 is a great place to start, as you'll be getting the NVIDIA RTX 3050 graphics card and an Intel Core i7-10750H processor. You also get 8 gigs of RAM, 512 gigs of storage, and you could also spend just a little above the 50k budget to get 16 gigs of RAM or upgrade it yourself or wait for a sale to get the 16 gig model. You also get a 15.6 inch full HD display with a 144Hz refresh rate. Its build is also pretty good with it just weighing 1.86 kilograms, and you can find the MSI GF6310 going for just 49,999 pesos. The HP Victus is a fan favorite as it boasts one of the better designs found on a gaming laptop, most especially with its ceramic white colorway. The Victus packs in the AMD Ryzen 5 5600H processor and up to an NVIDIA RTX 3050 Ti graphics card paired with 8GB of RAM and 512GB of SSD storage. And you may find that there are 15 and 16 inch versions of the Victus with the 16 inch being the latest model. Whichever you get, you'll be sure to get a panel with a 144Hz refresh rate for a smoother gaming experience. You can find the HP Victus for as low as 41,995 pesos with a GTX 1650 and 45,890 pesos with an RTX 3050 Ti, which is an absurdly great deal considering what you'll be getting. Last but not the least, we have the Gigabyte G5 GD. It packs in a 15.6 inch Full HD IPS display with a 144Hz refresh rate. It is also arguably one of the best packages you can find at this price point with an Intel Core i5 11400H, 16 gigs of RAM, 512 gigs of storage, and the NVIDIA RTX 3050 GPU. Coming in at just 46,995 pesos, the Gigabyte G5 GD has pretty much all you need specs-wise in a gaming laptop. Now there are so many great value and amazing laptops in this price category so we couldn't just leave them out the list. All the laptops mentioned in the top 10 just had a little edge over but to be brutally honest, these laptops could have easily made the top 10 as they are all still great buys at this price point. These include the Asus Rift 3, Acer Nitro 5, Lenovo IdeaPad Gaming 3 or 3i, Lenovo Yoga Slim 7 Pro, Lenovo Yoga 6, Asus Tough Dash F15, Asus VivoBook Slate 13 OLED, MSI Modern 14, and the Gigabyte UD4. We truly hope that our pretty extensive list of the best laptops under 50,000 pesos has helped you in making your next laptop purchase. If you like this video, be sure to smash that like button and leave us a comment on which laptop was your favorite or any other laptops under 50k you'd love to recommend. Be sure to also click that notification bell to be alerted of any content we post. Don't forget to also follow Yuga Tech in Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok, and visit yugatech.com for more of your favorite tech news and reviews. This has been VJ of Yuga Tech. See you next time.